I haven't named this base yet, but I just, I assume every base that I end up in is Berstatska. Am I stuck? Did I spawn stuck? That's pretty adorable. I'll just sit, I guess. And then stand. And then be stuck. <laughs> Feels home, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. This is just ideal right here. Let's go ahead and move this, I guess. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I can't believe I spawn like that. That's hilarious. Let me rebuild my chair real quick. Gotta be a command chair, you know that. I guess I need to leave a little bit more space there, huh? A renewal. Resurrectionist! Thank you for the 18 months in a row. No, sorry, 21 months in a row. Welcome on back in. It really just does not let you do things the way you want sometimes. Like, that's not where the chair goes. Come on. I gotta fucking... I gotta stretch fully out. Arms extended. To utilize my tools here. That's how I want to do it. My sub-anniversary. I can drink now. Gonna get a well message from my doggo Simon. Ah, he's got this sickness. Well, he's gonna be fine. That's the thing. is He's, he's gonna be totally fine. So, good. Yeah, glad to hear it. Okay, great. Repulsion cannon. Applies percussive force to entities in range. I could probably guess that. We've got a few different things in mind for me to do today. Got this battery charger down, by the way. I'm feeling pretty good about the base all of a sudden. We got a lot of neat stuff. This is life pod 7. Coordinates attached. Pod is structurally sound, but the fabricators bust. Hmm. Requesting assistance. 7 out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. All right. I just want to make sure there's nothing else in here that I really need to concern myself with. I did want to make some uh, plasti lingots for something, but I can't remember what that was for. Let me look at the. Uh, I think it was actually the uh, the fins. No, it wasn't the fins. We already made the fins. It was one of these new upgrades. Oh, it might have been the lightweight high capacity tank actually. But we do want to look into the uh, prawn suit as well. Prawn suit. Here we go. Oh, wait. No, that's going to be an upgrade. To make the prawn suit, we probably have to go to the vehicle station, don't we? Which we already have down. Hello there, fail s fair sailors of the seven seas. Hello there, pseudo. Oh, it's been a wonderful week. Neptune escape rocket. Huh? Oh. Oh, this is like endgame, I bet. Interesting. Okay. Well, here we go. Prawn suit. Epic mech suit designed for navigating challenging environments on foot. Plasteel, plasteel, aerogel, enameled glass, diamond, and lead. Hmm. Hi, Sundra. How you doing? Yeah, last time we did a little bit of Aurora exploration, and it resulted in uh, quite a few useful blueprints along with some resources, so that was a good use of our time, I'd say. But, uh, yeah, we need a lot of resources now for this high-tech shit so one thing i do want to do actually now that we've got the uh 300 meter capacity aboard, for our seamoth is go down a little bit further into that purple mushroom area and see what kind of resources we can find down there and as far as other plans go i am definitely thinking about building out the base in this direction maybe even like doing a little bit of a curve over here what the hell am i even hitting over in this area Sorry, hold on, I gotta rearrange all my shit. Do a little curve out like this. Building up, connecting these things maybe could be fun. No power bear. Oh, that's right, yeah, I keep forgetting about the power for this thing. Nagatonu! I watch the VOD, I want to see you play my favorite game from the start. Thank you for the pun included in that bit. Or in that cheer, rather. So how do you charge this thing? It's a power cell, right? So, oh, I just have to be in here. Swap the power cell out, right? Or no, it's outside. No, it's not. God damn it. I keep, I do R to switch it out, right? Or is it when you're in the Seamoth? There's a panel. All right, yeah, there's a fucking panel, I forgot. 
It's very particular. But that's not it. No, this is just the upgrade module. There's a different panel. Behind the mod. This seems like it's kind of difficult to figure out on your own, but okay. Anyway. There we go. I'm sure we'll be able to build the power cell charger. In fact, I'm pretty damn sure I have the blueprint for it, but not quite all the pieces for that blueprint yet. Okay, anyway. Oh yeah, we should probably go ahead and repair it too. While we're out. Alright. Let's get going. Takes a bit to understand. Yeah, a bit of a learning curve. Can upgrade the Depth Mark 1 into a Depth Mark 2 with a mod station. I don't think I've got that yet, though, do I? I'll hang out with 300 for a bit. I haven't even really utilized this yet. You don't have to skip steps all of a sudden. I'm beginning to build a little bit of familiarity with my uh, immediate surroundings. That feels nice. Not quite as lost as I'm wandering out into the uh, the shallow depths here. Here we go. This is my shit. Ooh, sneaky boy. All right, I feel safe in my sea moth. Yeah, shallow depths. Don't don't think too hard about that phrase. How many hours in? I think about nine now. Oh man. I'm gonna turn this up a little. This is great. This is great atmosphere. Did I scan these fish yet? I don't think so. Ooh, little peepers. Hey bud. <laughs> He's got a, a pink eye instead of a yellow one. Look at that. Shallow depths are just depths without personality. Yeah, they only see you at surface level. They just want to fuck. Ooh. Ooh, baby. Hang on, I gotta... I gotta see what's going on with this. Diamond! Worth it. Get back in. I don't want to be munched up by Snakey Boy. This is the point I chicken out. I'm getting a little concerned. Little, little concerned. We're in our sea moth. We're good to go. I can go even deeper. Could even go that way. Ooh. What are you? Oh, I see. It's a gold deposit. Okay. I still need to figure out... what tool I need to be able to break apart those deposits. This music, though. Oh, my God. That's a little unsettling. Okay. Take it easy. Seamoth is my friend. Oh, yeah. I don't like being out of it for a damn second. I need to be inside of this at all times. It's a lot of deposits. A lot of peepers. Ow. No, don't, don't, don't actually tell me, please. Please keep in mind, whenever I'm positing a question like that, 95% of the time it's rhetorical. Just wondering aloud, I'm not actually asking. Definitely gonna check this out, what the hell? All kinds of stingers in there, that's gonna be dangerous. Okay, just don't touch him, I guess. Oh, hi! 
Glad you couldn't eat me. Okay. Cool. Just gonna get my scanner out. Just gonna get my scanner out. There we go. Just a little terrified. Hey, that's good. Yo, that's big time. I definitely want this. Give me that. Could probably just stab these guys. Integrating new PDA data. Uh, let's see. We got. There we go. Thought it might get claustrophobic living underwater. Father feels it is. He'd tell me it was childish, but I stare out the window and sometimes I think how lucky I am to see this world up close. Back on the island, I wouldn't have believed the creatures that live down here. The fish, they glow. There's one that's ninety percent eyeball. Snakes twice the length of a that ain't working. apartment. Certainly, it's not all friendly. Most of the plant life is toxic. Learned that the hard way. But I've managed to coax some marble melons into growing indoors. And when they don't cover our dietary needs, well, we eat the fish themselves. It's a bit gross, but there's nothing they wouldn't do. I've been attempting to document my findings. Father approves. He says understanding is power. That the more we know about this planet, the more we can use it to our advantage. I'm just doing it because Ooh. it's fun. It's not easy without proper equipment and network access. But the old-fashioned way, observing, taking notes, testing theories, shows me the world in a way a spectroscopic analysis never could. Lately, I've been watching the crab snakes. They ambush their prey as it tries to feed on the mushrooms they hide in. What they don't eat settles on the seabed, which fertilizes the mushrooms, which feeds the herbivores, and so the chain continues. Coevolution gives me the fuzzies. Signal <laughs> location uploaded to PDA. He's cute. Okay. Well. Wow. Integrating new PDA data. <laughs> Fucking lame ass nerd. Alright, anyway. Nothing else in here, I guess. Oh, just kidding. Integrating new PDA data. Dude. This tank, though. This oxygen tank? Also, hell yeah, power cell charger fragment. I haven't had to recharge my O2 this whole fucking time. That's nuts. I am loving this. Okay. One more quick check. I'm terrified of snaky boys. Like that guy. Okay. Okay. Until it runs out and you die. Oh, well that's a pessimistic viewpoint though. That'll never happen. Fertile papyrus. Okay. All kinds of scanning. Am I lame for also getting the fuzzies from Coevolution? We'll never feel lame for having a passion for something. But we will laugh and go, <laughs> NERD! Something incredible just happened. Since we're down here, I had this plan to build equipment and study the life forms we were encountering. But I didn't have enough enameled glass. So, I started looking for a natural substrate that would strengthen the glass we have. And those stalker teeth we've been finding fit the bill. Only, well, we needed more. That's when Marguerite got interested. She actually listened to me. More than I can say for father. And I worked up the courage to talk about my more tentative theories. When I told her they were attracted to metal deposits, that their teeth get dislodged when they pick them up, her eyes narrowed and she dashed out of the room. Three hours later, she came back, her pack loaded down with stalker teeth. Oh, damn it. I asked her about it. She shrugged and said my theories were good. <laughs> said she had the meeting out of the palm of her hand. I think she meant it literally. She is incredible. She went out to the kelp forest armed with just a heat blade and went fin to fin with a pack of stalkers. On the one hand, that is the coolest thing I have ever heard. On the other, well, I hope the stalkers didn't come off worse than Marguerite did. She had a huge gash on her forearm. 
I don't think things went as smoothly as she made out. And what's the point in surviving here if we have to kill everything that makes it so wonderful? I wish I knew more about these animals. So deep. But father won't let me leave the habitat. Such a deep, troubled soul. We could build a containment unit and get up close to them. Integrating new PDA data. Swim into a shroom bear. I'd rather not die if I could avoid it. Son, there is always a pecking order. And in our world, money makes a hierarchy. I pay Maida a fraction of what I pay you, and you a fraction of what I pay me. If money makes the hierarchy, why is Marguerite making the decision? We need her. We let her think what she likes, so long as she does what she Go. Told. What if she doesn't? For enough money, she will. People always do. So much pressure, I know. God, I'm so deep. Just like Science Boy. Hashtag deep. We're getting low. We're already 200 meters below sea level. My shell you want to go deeper? Look around us, Chief. Water Deeper? The hole, water outside the hatch. We're drowning. We're drowning. If rescue arrives, whatever shot us down, it's going to do it again oh, and shit. again until it's shut off. Do you see an off switch around here, Chief? Why would it any more likely be half a kilometer down? Your kid found something on the scanner. There's something down there. Something that shouldn't be. There's something yeah, down yeah. there. I'm going all the same. And I have an idea you two are going to follow. But if you do, be mindful. Yo! Your authority stopped at sea level. What a line. Oh my god. Magnetite. I need that. Hell yeah. Let's go. Very good. Oh boy. There's a snaky boy in there, isn't there? All right, that'll do. Unless, maybe one more? Nope, okay. We're good. Yo, those magnets are tight, nice. Sherry Moore, thank you for the, uh, double hundred biddies for the nerd soap opera, appreciate it. Got a little more to hear, I think. You know what Maida told me today? She wants to build a habitat 500 meters below sea level. More than a kilometer northeast of here. She's ridiculous. She needs Bart and I to do it. She's got a tent ahead that she can save us oh, if she shit. just acts recklessly enough. But I've hauled Star Wars to Neptune, plus steel to the Neptune. <sighs> this family operates nine different mining colonies across the Ariadne Arm. Made her think she's better suited to lead. Her contract oh, fuck. still says otherwise. I just cannot <laughs> well tell whether it's the stupidest idea I ever heard. Or my only hope. I turned 80 years old last week. I thought I had another 80 in me, but marooned on this planet, there's no swapping out of my liver when the old one fails. Here, I'm mortal. A Maida is useful. So, it's my responsibility to make a decision. Return to the island and hope whatever not that the Ghazi out of the sky won't do the same to the rescue ship. Or take us deeper in search of answers. And all the while be hoping old age gets me before the sea monsters do. I'll give Maida just one thing. She was right about these caves. There's enough lithium there to fabricate a hundred tons of plasteel. Enough for a damn fleet of Cyclops submarines. There was nothing anyone could have done to avoid crashing here. But I was right to order the detour. If we get off this planet, they'll be talking uh, about the tall to girl's the share price on the other side of the Federation. <laughs> Genetic freak! Thank you so much for your subscription, buddy. Appreciate that. Welcome on into the pile. Enjoy your badge and emos. Full gold inventory. No way, dude. I gotta get that gold. Welcome to the bear pile. Gandalf the Grump. 
Thanks for someone with Twitch Prime as well. Appreciate that, friends. Thanks for the support. Oh, we gotta get that. Even with Snakey Boy around, we gotta check this out. First aid kit. Take a water. Thank you. The dude's accent is quite... Quite something. A whole kilometer! Praise Neptune! Just turned eight? Oh god, I killed a peeper. Hi. Alright, we full up again? Almost. Hang on. This magnetite, I think, is gonna be real good. Dude was probably playing golf on a floating island. What else would an 80 year old questionably Scottish man do? What else is a questionably Scottish man to do, I ask you? Where the hell do I get out? Eat haggis, I guess so. Oh, sand shark. I'm so lost. There we go. Was it Scottish or Irish? I don't even know. <laughs> it's... I went uh, to an acting class briefly, uh, like a year and a half ago. Actually, almost two years ago now, my god. And, uh... There was... There was an Irish girl in the class. And... I went up and uh, I did an exercise with her, and... The, uh, the instructor asked me if I could do... An Irish accent. And... I was like, no, but I can try. And what came out of my mouth was distinctly Scottish. And she, like, about like four words in, she was like, that's Scottish. And I was like, yeah, I can't do it. <laughs> I don't even want to try to repeat the sounds that I produced. Because it was probably racist, too, in a matter of speaking, but... That's not the, that's not the important point. How do I go? Oh, Jesus Christ! Get out of my Seamoth! This is my Seamoth! Fuck! Go away! Don't bite me! Uh, I'm stuck in the mushroom place! How do I get out? Help. Oh, please. Please. Yes. 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 Freedom. Oh, thank God. Thank God. I'm going home. Sorry, fish. I don't mean to do it. Silver, I need that. Thank you. I'm gonna play some of this in VR. I think I am, yeah. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do it for sure. So whether I stream it or not is the question. I know it's smoking. It's cool. It's fashionable. Don't hit me. That's the sound I made when I tried to do the Irish accent. You know, somebody suggested that. I just default to the to the gas manatee whenever I'm in a vulnerable position. Oh my god, I made it. If you puke on stream, you'll get a lot of hits. That's true, yeah, I'll end up on live stream fail.
That's a good goal. It's a noble objective. Don't hit me, I'm bare. <laughs> it's fixed. He's done it. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, friend. Here's all that titanium. Okay, we got a little silver ore here, too. Let's go ahead and put that in. Oh, man. Magnetite. Let's go. Tight, tight, tight. Let's replace some batteries, actually. Yeah, this one here I could swap off. Doo -doo -doo. Gotta go. Boop. And then... Oh, this one's real low. Boop. And then... We got one more, right? Probably the Habitat Builder. Oh no, that's all full. Nice. Laser cutter. There we go. Done. Okay. We take the full ones off. Put the empty ones on. I'm a smart boy! Smart, smart boy! There we go. He's doing it. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll play some more Kingdom 2 Crowns again eventually. Eventually. Not sure when. God, it's beautiful, isn't it? It's just majestic. Hey, friends. Piper, Peeper, and Pooper. That's Piper. No, that's that's Piper. Is that Piper? No, that's Piper. That's definitely Piper. Hi, Piper. You good boy. Can I make you a messenger for a very, very important message to bring to the rest of the world? Nah, I'm not really dependable for that. I'll fuck it up. I'm like single-handedly a terrible game of telephone. Repulsion... Oh, right, yeah, we need the propulsion cannon for that. And a computer chip, okay. I think I needed the magnetite to make the... Um... To make the giant frickin' mech suit, too, didn't I? Oh, I need to... Oh, shit! I can totally make this. With the magnetite. And then with the rubies, oh my god, I can get it to maximum depth. Uh-huh. We gotta do that. Hang on. So, what's the, what's the uh, priority list here? For plasteel ingots, enameled glass. We can make those things. They are the prawn suit. I know the prawn suit, but there's so many fun things to do. Enameled glass requires a stock or tooth in glass, which I do have. Uh, or don't I? Uh-oh. My Shelly all. We must go deeper. We need glass. We need quartz. All right, I'll have to find quartz real quick. Not get eaten. Have a little water first. I need to, you know, oh, I might actually even be able to build that water filtration station already. I should check into that real fast. Let me go get the quartz for the uh, glass real quick. I don't think the moon pod is blue, or the moon pod blueprint is complete. No, I'm pretty sure I have got a little bit of stuff left to get for that. Or just like one more. One more blueprint scan or something like that. I'm a little claustrophobic in here. I just need to correct everyone that reads the Italian GN wrong. It's supposed to be read like an Enye. Dude, I don't even know how to say that word the first way you spelled it. Like, I'm not gonna... I can't pass this message on. I can't even read your sentence. I told you, dude. I tried to tell you. This I'm, I'm bad at this. So, sorry. I failed. I told you I'd be set up for failure. You still lobbed the ball over the plate for me anyway, and I fucking... Swing and a miss, dude. Thanks. I got the quartz anyway, so at least I accomplished the objective I set for myself. To the bear pile. 64 syntax error! Bear hugs, please. Thanks for your subscription with Switch Prime. Much appreciated, buddy. I didn't even realize I... Oh, yeah. Forgot I dropped all that shit. 
cool. It's pronounced Balagna. Oh, okay. Understood. Glass. Next. Enameled glass. Hell yeah. There we go. Now, a reminder of the other pieces. I think we got the magnetite. Plasteel ingot, which requires what? We need a lot of titanium, because we need titanium ingots for that. And then what else? Lithium. Well, we can totally make that. Okay, so we just need to get all of our titanium out. And probably put away a bunch of other shit, because we don't have a lot of space for the titanium. We don't have any titanium, actually. Oh, shit. How many titanium do we need for an ingot? Ten! Wow. Alright, that's gonna be hard. Um... Then the plasteel ingot required how many of the titanium ingots? Just one, okay. So we need... How many of those? 20 titanium, I guess? Or how many of those was it? Just one plasteel ingot. So yeah, we just need... Oh, we just need actually, like, six. Seven. Seven titanium. We can get that. Easy peasy. I keep dumping that titanium, though. Actually, I need space. You know what I need to do is use the damn storage! But where's the storage? Does this have storage? Is this what I was thinking had storage? Or is that something else? Maybe it's like underneath it. That's the power cell. You need two plasteel ingots since Mark III also needs one. Oh, you have to add the storage. Okay. Welcome aboard, Captain. Got it. Okay, let's go find a few smashy rocks and get some titanium. Hopefully even maybe find something to scan. Totally forgot I had full inventory again. God damn it. Bear Taffy. Pay attention, buddy. Pay attention to the needs. I do like my base. I'm a fan of how we got things set up here. God, that is full too. Holy shit. I might have to build another locker, but that requires fucking titanium. It's a never-ending cycle. Let's put all that away for now. That'll do. Okay. Just put stuff in the locker, lol. Titanium, please. I would like to find some titanium. I need lots of it. Ooh, something to scan would be even better. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Oh, that'll work, actually. Yeah, some scrap metal. I'll just take that from them. In fact, I think there's a bunch of scrap metal around us. Maybe I should just go back and get that. That'll probably be faster. I don't need that. Hello, goodbye. I'm just kind of exploring now. Wandering about. Yeah, the stalkers seem to really like that scrap metal, huh? And I know they I know they uh, threw a few around our base. There's really not a lot going on down here. Alright, well, anyway. Yeah, let's go ahead and go back and get some scrap. Forgot that really is a much easier way to uh, collect titanium. Metal salvage. Sven, hello! going good. How are you? Yeah, here's a little more. Okay. I wish there was a quick way to break it down on the fly, but that's asking a little too much, I guess. I gotta put away the uh, rad helmet as well. That's a lot of space in the inventory that I've not been utilizing. Good to hear, Sven. Yeah, I've also been enjoying them. It was such a rat helmet, that's true. Hard to give it up. Practicality over performance, though, right? Or over looks, anyway. I just wanted the alliteration. Fabrication! Oop! Ugh. Okay, there's our titanium ingot, so that ought to get us the first module complete. Made a plasteel ingot, goddamn. 
feel like I'm in RimWorld again. And I think I need a magnetite, don't I? Yeah, two magnetite in the, mo in the depth module, so we gotta get that out of the thing. I love that, by the way. That's so cool that you actually have to pop this open to access the upgrade and get it out. Welcome aboard, Captain. Get the magnetite. Pop this in here. There we go. You never left Rimworld Bear, you never leave. I guess so, huh? Here we go! That was a little anticlimactic, I guess. Cool! Okay, now we need the Plasteel Ingot again, and three rubies, which we do have. Which, you know, might as well go ahead and do this, so... Let's go get more titanium. And we got the space for it, I think, too. Yeah. Sure. Seven titanium, that shouldn't be too bad. Pretty damn sure there's some scrap right here, too, yeah. Ruby, Ruby, Ruby! One or two ought to do it. Scrap metal. Yeah, scrappy, 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 scrappy. I bet there's some over here, huh? Nah, just stupid fish. Per perpetually trapped in a motionless void. Yay! Oh, here we go. Sweet. That'll do. Sometimes I forget, man. All this fancy tech. I go back to basics here. It's how to do it, though. You're stuck in my emotional state? Nice, nice. Me IRL. Plasteel. And then grab the ruby and we are in business. Mm, where is it? In here? Yeah. I'm so glad I got three. If I had two, I'd be so upset. Hell yeah. There it is. Wow. Mark three death module for the sea moth. That was easy. Oh, God. Access upgrades. There we go. Done. 900 meters? What? Yo! We can go even deeper. That's crazy. Okay. Now, next step has got to be the giant frickin' mech suit, right? We gotta work on that. So, what resources do we need? Plasteel ingot, two of them. Aerogel, enameled glass. Unfortunately, I used my only uh, shark tooth or whatever the fuck it is for that. So we need to find more. Aerogel, I think we could make as well, although I think I actually needed ruby for that too. So there's quite a few resources we need to find for it. All right then, well, maybe not that right now. Let me have a quick look at the Habitat Builder again and see if there's a few things that I can add on at the moment. Let's see. Thermal plant converts heat to energy at medium efficiency. That's interesting, probably don't need that right now. Water filtration machine, yes. Turns seawater into water and salt, yo. You can build log lockers that have labels on them. Oh yeah, that's neat, okay. Titanium, copper wire, and aerogel. That is big. Welcome to the fair pile. Lumpy 700! Thank you very much for your subscription, my friend, with Twitch Prime. Appreciate, bud. Er, appreciate that, buddy. Welcome on in. Aerogel with the gel sack and the ruby. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, so that's gonna be kinda tough. Hmm. Copper wire I can make now, though, obviously. Yeah, all right, I might as well. So. Oh, did we unlock the scanner room too? Hang on. Power cell charger we did unlock. We need Ruby for that too, God damn it. But we do want to get a power cell charger, obviously. Let's see. So many fun things. 
So the room would be... Oh, there. Yeah, we don't have all the ingredients for it yet. We still have to find the moon pool, too. Ugh. I've got an aerogel in my lockers, do I? I'll certainly check on that. Let's have a look. We got some power cells, batteries, not in that one. I guess I should label these, huh? Oh, I guess I need to make the right kind of locker, don't I? I wonder if it's a wall locker instead of a floor locker. Oh yeah, there we go. I got some aerogel, okay. How many did I need? Doo -doo -doo. Oh! Well, shit! There we go. Need two titanium, we're in business. I do have a bed, actually, uh, because we see yeah, I could sleep to get to daylight right now, but I've got a couple other things I gotta find first. Just gotta get some metal scrap real quick. There's some straight up titanium. If I can get lucky. Scrappy, scrappy, scrappy boys. No, that's not what I wanted to see, son of a bitch! <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, here we go. Thank you for all the salvage, buddy. Straight up titanium. Cool, thank you. All right. Just what I needed. I guess that's just what I needed. I needed something to flee. Whoa! There we go. Need stalker teeth, too. Do you get those just from killing those sons of bitches? I'll just stab a bitch and give me some stalker teeth? Alright, here we go. Ooh, this is a big boy. Alright, we need some space for this puppy. Uh, we might want to build out that way then. Which probably requires a little more titanium. Give them some metal to chew on and they'll drop teeth. Oh, that's why they're chewing on that scrap all the time. Oh, okay. Understood. Let's go ahead and expand a little. Oh, I want... Okay, I'm gonna get glass. I'm totally gonna get some more glass. Some more quartz. I want some fancy-ass glass tubes, dude. It matters to me. It matters. I want to be fancy and aesthetically pleasing. Mago Samflos! Thanks, Bear, for providing me entertainment while my arm recovers from being stabbed with a hypodermic needle. Oh, fun. Glad to have you, buddy. Thanks for being here. I'll take a little copper. I gotta get some quartz. This stuff helps, too. God damn you. Still fucking freak me out. Oh, that's not even... salvage. Hi! No! No thanks. Quartz? Anywhere? I feel like I took it all. Where's the quartz? Hmm. I've come across the Leviathan, yeah. No spoilers, though. That's a, it's a risky question. I just gotta keep people informed about that. Asking, have you seen X yet? Immediately spoils the fact that there is indeed an X. So, just please be wary. There we go. All right, a little more. I want, like, four total to bring home. How much space do I even have? One more slot. Perfect. Cool. Well, I guess I need to drop a little bit of this then. Although I did want most of it. God damn it. I need space for everything. Two more slots. And no more salt. Don't bring salt back. We don't need that right now. We need quartz. Have you seen the ocean yet? Wow. Can we get a ban, please? Good lord. Spoilers. That's salt. That's me, that's, that's, right there. 
That's bear taffy after that fucking spoiler in chat. Is there an ocean in this game? My god, I didn't know that. I had no idea. Love this music. God, it's so good. Love this O2 tank too, man. Are you kidding me? Like we're down to 60. Still got forever to go here. Okay, I just really want one more quartz. Hey, has Bear found this super great plot twist? Here's a few details about it. Just in case. You were confusing it for this other great plot twist that he didn't see yet. Like I care. There's so much salt around here. Good lord. Alright, fine. I guess I'll ascend. Oh, there's the quartz I've been looking for. This is the quartz I'm looking for. Hurry up. Hurry up. Whee! And straight down. Has he seen the water yet? This is getting out of hand. Take it out of emote only for five seconds. My goodness. <laughs> Look at these people in line. Jesus Christ. Oh, fake outrage. It's hilarious, Bear. Truly just the peak of comedy. One more quartz? What about one more quartz? What about one more itsy bitsy quartzy poop? Maybe not. Just to make one more glass? There it is! Two even! Oh, hi! Yeah, sure, go ahead and blow up in my face. Why not? You know what? I'm taking the other one, goddammit. I'm taking the other one, too. You know what? If there's a, a sixth one, I'll take that. That's titanium. I don't need that shit. Plenty of that around. Alright, there we go. We're in business. Let's go. He's done it. He's found the way. He's found a way. Yep. Please mod me so that I may continue to post spoilers in emote only mode. <laughs> I thought that red grass was weird water, then I remembered you were underwater. Some SpongeBob shit right there. Mm hmm. Got all kinds of fun foliage, man. Well, there are moments where, you know, like. You're indoors and your your knife makes bubbles. You start to question the laws of physics in this reality, so I can kind of see where you're coming from. Okay, gotta remember what I was doing here. I'm gonna get some glass. Boop. I hate how there's no ladder animation. I love it, dude. It's so much quicker. I don't need to see my guy walking up and down the ladders every time. Unnecessary for me. L compartment. Uh, where is it? It's not showing up. Hang on. Gotta do it outside. Ah, uh, here we go. Can't do it there. Wonder why. Probably a locker. That's a, oh, that's sort of frustrating, actually. I mean, I have to move all that shit out of there because of the storage, huh? Yeah. Oh man. Okay. Well, I guess the easiest way to do it would be to just move or uh, to create another locker right there, and then just move everything little by little bit. I can put some titanium in here too. 
Okay. Oh, hang on. This as well. Yeah, let's go ahead and make another locker real quick. Let's make a wall locker so we can uh, label it. Then we don't need quartz for it either. Yeah, that's nice. It's probably less storage space, but I don't really mind that. There we go. Then you can name it. Oh man, yeah, I like that a lot. Cool. So. We'll just call it Metals. Metrals! And there's, yeah, there's really not a lot of space at all, but it'll work. And, uh, let's do... P-Metals. We'll call it P-Metals. For precious. Leave the R. <laughs> it doesn't mean anything now. Now it means literally nothing. But we do need to keep the label proper, I guess. So we gotta put only gold and diamonds and whatnot in there. Gold! Little organization. Little inventory organization. That's always thrilling stuff for the stream. Only oh, yeah, one quartz on. Okay. Diamond in here. We'll go for the, uh, we'll put the salt in there. Switch a Rooney. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. And then. Almost. Almost ready. Almost ready. I'm gonna put the lead in there too. Yeah, and probably the lithium as well. That works. Oh, got the water. Nummy! P metrals. Everyone knows what those are. Okay, cool. Pretty good. Almost done. Just gotta move all these batteries and shit. Which we can just hang on to, and then we can deconstruct this puppy. Cool. There we go. Alright, got a little quartz out of that too. And now, finally, uh, let's go. Bam. There it is. Gotta make sure it's in the right direction though, so let's go out here first. DAE diamonds aren't metals, god damn it. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's some fancy shit. I love that. Worth the investment of time. And now we build another room. I think. Hmm. Could build a, uh... Hmm. I'm trying to think of what I want to do here. I don't think a room's going to fit very well right there. Oops. I guess I could see. Let's go grab some titanium, see what kind of space we're working with here. Oh, I love it. Love it. Beautiful. Okay. All right, yeah, titanium. Okay, let's see. Let's go with multi-purpose and see what we're doing here. Oh, okay, yeah, a little connector out there. But why can't it build there? Does it connect poorly with the foundation or something? Yeah, I guess so, huh? Shit. Man. Hmm. If I take off the upper hatch, it might fit. Let's try that. No. Eh, it's the foundation, I think. Darn it. Yeah, I guess we'll have to do like a T hallway or just another uh, extension. My poster! Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, God, that was close. Um. Hmm. Observation room. That could be cool, actually, yeah. Kind of caps off the uh, hallway a little too quickly, though. I do want to do this somewhere, but uh, 
I, tell you, I missed an opportunity for a flying poster. That's true. Uh, I'll tell you what. I want to probably do something like this. Maybe just like another L glass compartment. Except it's going to look a little weird. Yeah, it's going to look a little weird. Let's not do that. Let's do a... Uh, yeah, a T might work. Because then we can build out the other way, too. Hmm. High T. Mm -hmm. Low T because it's underwater. Yeah, that's true. Wait, is there a... Uh, is there a glass T compartment? No. Yeah, okay. Okay, then. Oh, yeah, I could make a hatch there. That's true. That works pretty well. Can we make the observatory here? There's not really a lot to look at, though. Why don't I make that a... Hang on. First of all, oh, I'm out of space. Um, God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. Um, just gonna put some batteries away, I guess. Boop, 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 boop. I wanna redo this. Oh, yeah, the fire extinguisher, right. Just leave that on the ground outside. That's fine. I guess I can put it, like, indoors. It can be practical with it. Hang on. Every good base needs a fire extinguisher. In the corner. How the hell do I drop it now? Can I not drop it now? The fuck? I don't have an option. Why can't I only drop it outside? That's so weird. No littering in the base, I guess. Okay. You say so, game. Alright, anyway. Finish deconstructing this. And... Yeah, I know. Hang on. Emergency power only. Get another solar panel up real quick. Get it up here. Look, it's even logical because this is like outdoors. There we go. Cool. That's kind of neat. And then. Let's make sure there's nothing else getting interrupted in here. Emergency power only. Oh, there's... Oxygen production offline. What? Why? Oh, right. Nighttime. <laughs> yeah, it's not going to give me power right now. Okay. Anyway. Um... Oh, man. I hate this little fucking hatch. I really wish I hadn't done a cross joint here. And instead of done a T. But I don't think I want to unload all the fucking storage just to fix it. Could build out from it that way. Time to rebuild everything from scratch. No. Nah, I guess I'm just going to tolerate it. Does a multi-room fit there? Let's see. I'm going to move the Seamoth probably. Uh, yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, you know, that would work. We can use that for sure. Why not? Cool. Yeah, that looks neat. Bit of an awkward uh, hatch now, though, but we'll probably put another one on the other side, too. 
Yeah, we'll probably make that the filtration room, huh? We'll hop in there for that. No, oh, yeah, there's no power still. God damn it. Um. Hmm. How else do you make power for the base? There's got to be a, dif a different way for it. Converts heat to energy at medium efficiency. Probably with this thermal plant, huh? Hamster wheel. There you go. Okay, well, this is what I wanted to make anyway, so we could probably do it without power. Oh, yeah, bioreactor. Hang on, I had the stuff for that, uh, or I had at least the blueprint for that, didn't I? Yeah, ooh, wiring kit and lubricant. I can make that. Organic matter into electrical energy. Interesting, okay. Yeah, we can definitely make that. But first... Cool. We'll put that right there. Probably get a lot of space to utilize in this room. Nice. Still unpowered, obviously. We get another bulkhead, I think. I probably got a little rubber left over. Nope. Not a bit. Oh, just kidding. There we go. Well, maybe not a bulkhead. How about just the uh, reinforced wall? Yeah, it's fine. Can do one of these two. Oh, we can't? Never mind. Probably got to be in the uh, multi-purpose room, I guess. Yep. There we go. That's better. That's better. Hey, there we go. Power restored. All primary systems online. All right. Feels good. Let's have a look. Filtration progress. Turn it on. You can put stuff in the filtration machine? Huh. Okay. Well, it's working anyway, I think. Oh, I lack power. Oh, shit. Okay, I do need to do more power stuff then, I see. Well, let's have a look at the bioreactor. Well, hold on. Which one's better, I wonder? A nuclear reactor. Holy shit. So we have the bioreactor and we have the thermal plant. Oh, I can't build the thermal plant without aerogel, though. So I guess it's the bioreactor. So let's go wiring kit and lubricant. Or I could probably do one more solar panel, actually. That would probably be the easiest way to do it, huh? I didn't even think about that. But I'm kind of curious to build this, too. Let's see if I've got the resources. I think I have lubricant. Yeah, I've got lubricant. And for the wiring kit, we needed what? Here. Here you go. Oh, it's all fucking unpowered now. Well, all right. Tell you what. We'll just build another solar panel real fast because we need the power, clearly. Titanium and copper. Boop. Nope, not that. And boop. And out we go. Solar panel number two. Got to point it toward the sun. Where is the sun? Where's the sun? There's no sun. Is it behind this thing? Must be. Here you go. Done. Sick. There's the sun. There you are. That's more like it. The sun revolves around the planet. Everybody knows that. Yeah, duh. People keep telling me to go check the uh, escape pod storage. So I'll go do that. 
Or like storage on the other side of it or something? Hmm. All right, yeah, I got a first aid kit in here still. Oh yeah, this thing, this storage, that's right. That's right, I totally forgot I put all this shit in here. Creature egg, titanium. Bunch of eggs, really. Yeah, it's actually not all that good. Oh well. Gotta remember I've got that, though. Whee! Alright, how are we doing on power now? Looking good. Cool. So we need to make... What was it, a wiring kit, I'm pretty sure? Bioreactor, wiring kit, and titanium. Silver ore. Easy. Do we do? Do. All right. No, I'm pretty sure I've emptied out the floating lockers outside. That was an early objective. One more titanium. He's done it. All right, let's put the bioreactor in here. Wow. Okay. A reliable power source is a critical step towards self-sufficiency. Consider keeping a photo journal of your achievements to motivate you in times of despair. Organic matter. I'm guessing fish. Okay. Put some fish in it. Seems very humane. I trapped the fish in my perpetual stasis device. And then I feed them to my engine. They live a very good life, these fish. Just wish I could free these ones. They're just stuck here forever. Oh, acid mushrooms. Yeah, that would probably work too, huh? You put all the non-subs in there. Yeah, that's right. My sherry ammo! Turn Piper into energy. Make him pay the rent. Hell no. Alright, use your Twitch Prime sub now. Lest ye be turned into organic matter and uh, fed to our bioreactor. That'll do. Five. Oh, it's going up. Okay. Thank God. Can you free them with a knife? I can free them from this mortal coil with a knife. That looks healthy. Num, num, num. All right. Well, we got power now. We're making salt and water. Oh, boy. Cool. Some fishes and plants give more than others. Yeah, I figured. Oh. All right. All right, man. We are feeling fine here, I think. I have some potatoes and melons. I'm gonna plant the new melon, though. Num, num, num. Food for days. Now I just need to make a little uh, water for myself. How long is this going to take? I wonder if it's really going to be quick enough for me to rely on it for my water needs. All oh, right, yeah, you got to knife the melon for seeds. I always forget that. There we go. Plant them up. Okay. Have a grow bed full of them right by the reactor. That seems like a good idea, actually. Yeah. I had to consider that. Sleep to speed the time. Oh, true. Yeah, I forgot about that, too. I gotta go find that tree as well so I can plant that and have ourselves a good supply of, uh... Of, uh, healing resources. I guess I can rebuild this hatch again. Uh, there we go. Oh, I need quartz. God damn it. 
Maybe I just won't. So much to do. I know I haven't even utilized my new Seamoth yet. We've got a 900 meter depth. We can go exploring and shit. I don't think I need any more of this stuff. Okay. Anyway. Yeah, resources looking good. I need some water. That's pretty much it. I haven't even built the epic mech suit yet. That's right. Okay. I'm gonna plant this. Get the creep vine. There's really only one way out right now. Plant the creep vine. Man. I'm gonna take out this coral. Is it just there forever? There we go. Drop that, drop that, drop that, drop that. Boom. There we go. That's better. That's better. I guess I'll keep that. Actually, it's pretty big, isn't it? No, it's normal size. Okay. Neat. That'll do. I'm going to... Rest. Put those samples in the... All right, yeah, put them in the bioreactor, duh. We can use them for stuff. And this acid mushroom, too. Give me that. Oh, where'd they go? Where'd they go? They're gone. Rip, they're gone. All right. I did my best. I'm gonna get a bunch of mushrooms, actually. Hell yeah. There we go. Oh, is it by the new creep vine? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Damn it. Alright, that'll do. That'll do. Woo, shit! 69. Nice. It made salt for me. Thank you. How kind of you. Oh, it's full up. I see. Well, I'll just go ahead and drop a bunch of this shit right here. Alright, yeah, I can't litter the base. Fuck. Okay, well, we'll put a bunch of organic stuff in here then. Cool, that'll do. A little salt. Noist. Oh, we have diamonds in here. And magnetite. That's not good. There we go. And then the rubber. Good shit. Oh yeah, I put up the poster again too, of course. How dare I forget. Well, I mean, I am gonna put up the, uh... I'm gonna put up the 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 hatch again, so I don't know if I want to do it there. Put it over another poster like a fucking kid. Here we go. <laughs> it's beautiful. So many chores, I know. All right, let's go. Let's get out of here. I'm ready. Gotten so much done. Oh, wait, no, there's one more thing I wanted to do. I wanted to get these, uh, creep vine seeds and, uh... Oh, there's none to har there's none to harvest. Or are there? There we go. There's a lot to harvest. I wanted to get these and make some fiber mesh. And store that, because that sounds like a good thing to get. I went a little further into the pink mushroom cave, yeah. Oh, whoops, that's... Oh, wait, no, yeah, lubricant is what you get from that. That's right. That's what I wanted anyway. I gotta make some bleach. Some filtered slash purified slash disinfected water. And then we'll be good to go more than likely. That's a lot of lube, actually. Didn't realize I got so many. Holy shit. There we go. And sustenance, you need to get bleach, which we make by doing... Oh, I have got the complete wrong idea in mind. 
I'm making lube and silicone from this stuff. I I thought I needed totally different resources. Okay, anyway. Um, well, that's good to have anyway. Press shift while crafting. Yo, have you just given me the keys to the kingdom? I didn't even realize. But I need to get more coral, or uh, table coral, and then the salt I can use to make the disinfected stuff. And we got some table coral right over here. Do do do. Hi. Bye. Nope. Did I? Yo, did I stab him to death? Could I have been doing that the whole time? I don't think I need more mushies. Hmm. Ooh, shit. Creepy. Creepy. They can be felled. They can be beaten. Yeep. Hello. Hello! Okay, he still blew up. Still hurt a little bit. I need more table coral, actually. Not looking for the right stuff. Another one falls! Where's the table coral at? There you are. Come here. Come here. That's probably enough. I know. That's what I'm working on. Okay. Here we go. Oh, it's not tabled. It's tube. Son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, all these different ways to... Goof up. Well, I got two coral right here anyway, don't I? There we go. Got all the different kinds of resources. It's all good anyway. A few salts and we'll be in great shape. It's great! There we go. God, look at all that power we have. Gods, I had so much power then! Yay, Bleach. Unlimited cosmic power! Itty bitty living space. Consume. Vital signs stabilizing. Nummy, nummy, nummy. All right. We'll do two more. For the road. And then, uh, probably get out of here. Go explore in the depths a little bit. Okay. Check the water filter. All right, yeah. That too. Mm-hmm. Okay. I love this, man. That's such a good addition. As soon as I get there, hell yeah. Large filtered water. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Fuck yeah, dude. Pure. Pure water. Hail hydration. Consume that tasty beverage. Oh, yeah. Well, I need some more food, too, actually. Hang on. 
Yeah, the water sound from that machine is very satisfying. Absolutely. Okay, so I've got way too much table coral now. I gotta remember what you actually use that for, too. Maybe just whip up a few of those. Table coral you get with... what? Not that. Computer chips. Oh, well. We don't really need that many of those. Uh, shit. Okay. Yeah, I guess that was just kind of unnecessary to grab all that. Yeah. Well. Here's a pile of it for later. Boom. I don't think we even need more bioorganic fuel, do we? This thing's basically... Oh, wait. No, yeah, there are actually a few slots. But we're probably fine. This is awesome. I'm loving this. It's a great new room. Okay, anyway. I think we're ready now, finally. After I get a little bit more food in me. Munch these up. Cool. Alright, let's do it. Put away the resources. We got bunches of water. We got some first aid, a nutrient block. Let's move, my friends. Out the door we go. Off with my new sea moth to a depth of 900 meters. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Hey, Bear, how about, you, how about you build a locker in the organic room? That's a very good idea. Yeah, remind me to do that, actually. That's a good call. Got a couple extra power cells on me, too, actually, so I'll be good to go with this sea moth for a while. Let's go find that moon pool. Or some quartz. I'll take that. Oh, save. Also a good call. Yes, sir. Oh, you know what? Let's hit up this beacon. That's a depth of 500 meters. We couldn't get there before. Well, with the Seamoth, anyway. I don't know if my guy could get there by himself. Do -do -do -do. I could probably go for some more titanium, too. I'll probably go for some scans where I can see him. Whoa. Time to do your best reef back impression, chat. Just some uh, lithium, I think. Lead. Okay. Your character can go as deep as you want. Oxygen is the only issue, and then the oh right, yeah, the giant sea demons, right? Yeah, that's a whole other thing, I guess. I've met a little bit of danger noodle. Yeah, I don't know if I've met your danger noodle, but again, I'd ask, please, not to ask the uh, specific "has he met X, Y, or Z creature" questions. That does tend to spoil. Pastor Gaines! Bear hugs, please, in the chat. Thank you very much for your subscription, Pastor. Appreciate that. Look on into the pile. Have you met X, Y, or Z creature? You're all hilarious. You're all very, very funny. And you should know that. Yeah, this is pretty, isn't it? More quartz, you know. I do need it. I need more glass. I gotta make my my base look nice. I don't think I've been here either. Those look like creature eggs. Hmm. Ooh, that looks like um a uh, gel sack. I want that. These are cool. 
Neat. Oh, right. Yeah, I've already seen those. What? Oh, this is not my scanner. I, I didn't know what I was looking at. There we go. Obviously, I can already build that one, too, which I completely forgot about. That's another deposit. Okay. Hmm. This will go on YouTube, yeah, for sure. More lithium. Oh, boy. Oh, hello. What's that? What's that? Hold on a second. Thing near your Seamoth scandal. I gotta rearrange my shit here, hang on. That does not need to be in there. Scanner, knife, light, laser cutter, and fucking sea glide. Wherever that ended up, there we go. Scannable? 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 My inventory's full! Good lord. Let's drop this, I guess. I don't need that stuff. Yeah, I got too much crap in my bags, it's true. I got a lot of unnecessary garbage, probably. Okay, anyway. Yeah, lots of water, too. It's probably unnecessary to bring that much. It's stacked up quick. Oh, Ruby! Yo, yes! Yep, that's gonna take the place of all the titanium, 100%. Ruby, 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 Ruby! And a fucking man-made filtration system? The fuck? Welcome to the bear pile. Crazy Canuck! Welcome to the bear pile, my friend. These vents connect to an ancient piping network that extends beyond maximum scannable depth. The pumping system is still functional. Alien vent. That doesn't make me feel good. I got sucked into it! Ah, oh, poor peeper! Watch out, guys! Suck! Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah, it's titanium. Just drop that. Don't hit me. Don't hit me! Ow, God! It hurts! God damn it. Ooh. Time capsule? Yo. Give me the goods. Survive, my friend. I will. Survive to do something great. He gave me chips. Fuck yeah, buddy. Thank you. A large filtered water and a nutrient block. Hell yeah, man. I'm saved. I am saved. Keep her like son of a bitch, not again. Well, I gotta get these gel sacks for sure, man. What is that? Oh, Ruby. Yo, I gotta dump something. Hang on. I've got way too much shit. I've got two beacons. I don't like this. I don't like these sounds. Stop. Stop it! It's doing it as soon as I get out of my fucking inventory. I'm out of here. Yeah, the time the uh, time capsule mechanic is really cool. I like that a lot. I didn't even realize we're at 300 meters. Holy shit. We must go deeper. Ooh, that's a new plant. All right, that's got to be scannable. No? Oh, okay. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. I shouldn't go much further, like... I've got a full inventory again. I could probably dump all this shit. I don't 
probably have a lot of good stuff though. Got rubies. Nope. 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 No. No. What is that? Go dump your inventory. I kind of want to. Ugh! Oh, it's just... It's just some base thumping is all. That's okay. That's fine. That's fine. That just looks like an egg, too. I'm gonna get out of here. Bye! I hate it! Bye! I hate everything about this! Are those eggs? It's like infection. Oh, you. Yucks. Yuck. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. I'll remember you all in therapy. It's one of the best lines in that whole damn show. Hey, I didn't die. I need more allowance, Yodelehi who. Why? Because I do! Who got that? Who got that reference? Who got that reference? Come on now, somebody got that reference. No, I need, uh, I need to clear out this damn inventory space. Need a lot more. Mm. Oh. Brave, brave Sir Taffy ran away. Are you using your vehicle's inventory? I, I need a, an inventory module? I suppose, which I suppose I ought to invest in, since I clearly continue to have inventory issues, so. I don't know if I have that module researched, though, so. I'll probably just have to work with what I got for now. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Yeah, I could probably ditch the Sea Glide at this point, too, huh? That's a valid point. I haven't really been utilizing it very much at all, and it doesn't even need to be on a, on a quick slot anymore, either. All right. Let's see. Got some silver that I can't even fit in there anymore. I guess all the metal's going in this one at this point. Let's do it. And that's a full one. My God. Okay, so then... Tell you what, we are going to go ahead and whip up a new uh, locker over here. I don't have any titanium, my god. I keep running out. Do I have enough though? I think I have enough to make the uh, locker at least. So let's do that, and then we're going to make a uh, an organic materials locker over here. Yay stuff! Oh, it's so satisfying. All the way up! All the way up! Boom. Okay. And then, uh, yeah. That's that, pretty much. Creature egg, I guess. We'll keep all these things. I'm gonna keep a couple beacons for myself. Uh, we'll put the sea glide away. Right here. I guess I could probably put these in the, uh, organic thing, huh? There we go. Sea Glide stored. There we go. Let's actually put these in the bioreactor right now. There we go. I should grow some of the gel sacs. Yeah, I am already growing one of them, I believe. So I could go have a look at that. Let's put the uh, salt away too. Ooh. 
Check it out. Oh, was that just... Oh, I might have to cut it, huh? A renewal. Welcome back. Andre DK! Do I have to wait for it to grow, or can I just knife it now? Andre, thank you for the five months as well. I need the moon pool yet. I still need to find that. I haven't been able to find the other blueprint piece for the moon pool. You can do it now? Okay. There we go. Now we get the seed for it. Got it. Gotcha. I'd probably, I'd probably do it a couple times, huh? There we go. Cool. Okay. That does that. I got one more slot, though. I'd feel stupid not using it. Oh, two more slots. Okay, that's fine. Two slots is acceptable. All right, then. Let's actually hit an objective, shall we? We haven't, we haven't done that in a minute. <laughs> this is kind of cute. Okay, let's get going. Welcome aboard, Captain. I have a nutrient block. Actually, we'll hold off on a second on that, but I got a lot more inventory space now. This feels good. Some first aid, some power cells. Let's get going. <laughs> Looks like your sea move. Is your sea moth pooped? Indeed. <laughs> So many fun things to do, man. I love this game. This is a good time. Still waiting on that bear taffy sound pack. Yeah, one day. I do need some more titanium, actually. As much as I don't want to fill up the inventory with that immediately, I am pretty much out of titanium, so it's not a bad idea. I don't want to take that, though. I'd actually find a moon pool and just this random stray shit over here. Scanner room fragment. There we go. Let's just salvage. I don't know if that's a specific room there. Okay. Yeah, we'll probably get, get to that uh, 500 meter beacon. It sounds good. What's the, oh, a vending machine. And then let me scan it, though. The SEMA fragment, too. It's gonna get to 6,900 meters for the next part, right? Nice. There we go. Okay, still... Yeah, God, we still have some, just not a lot of inventory space. I probably didn't need to bring nearly this much water. It's a little overkill, I guess. Oh, well. I really like the sound the Seamoth makes. I'm getting into quite the particulars of parts of this game I enjoy, but it's a satisfying little scuttle. It's great sound design. Yeah, I really just... The amount of times I've just been genuinely horrified with no justification for feeling that way beyond just the presentation of the game itself. And man, just these moments too, just descend, descending deeper into the depths. They're the way of the VR yet? No, I haven't yet. I gotta do it though. I know everybody keeps mentioning it's something that I gotta check out. Sorry! Ooh, hello? God, it's dark down here. I don't know if that's actually scannable. Well, let's keep going. Oh, hold on. I need to... Oh, this is where I was. Right, okay. So, we need to go this way. God, I can't stop! It was scannable? Ah, oh, man. I, that one ran into me! 
Oh my lord. Am I stuck in here? Where the hell am I? Interesting, okay. Oh, a little bit of monka, huh? Oh boy. That always is very reassuring to me. I'm find a way around, I guess. I don't want to hit those things. I feel like they'll blow up. My sherry and more. Biodiversity is low because you keep killing all of it. Fair point. Ooh, baby. Warping aliens? Uh-huh. That's an alien. Yep. Oh. Or maybe that's just a fish? Aha! Uh -huh. Yeah, you look really fucking freaky. Whoa! Unable to confirm whether it originated on the Aurora. This thing's coming right at me, isn't it? I can't tell. It moves so fast. Yep! Oh! Yo! Go away, fuck! Jesus! Ah! Ugh. Get in! Yo! He turned my light off. And he ate my sea moth. Leave it alone. Oh, some drinks. That's horrifying. Oh, cool. Oh, hell yeah! Madrina's boys! It's about goddamn time. I need my fix. He's pissed. He mad? He mad as hell. It's like as soon as I turn on a light, he gets pissed off. Is my Seamoth still on? Okay, good. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Run. No! Shit! I have a new power cell. Oh boy. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Get to the right one! Hurry! Fuck! Run! It's not on! Oh, it's fine. Okay, we're good. Run. He's terrifying. What the fuck? Go away! I know I need to repair him running. Jesus Christ. We're so deep. Oh, fuck. Surface. Surface. Holy fucking shit. We went so far down. Okay. Whew.
Wait a minute, I'm not even going up anymore. I got completely turned around. Whoa. Look behind you, bear. Yeah, we're probably fine. Woo, man. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, okay. That feels a little refreshing. Jesus Christ. Fix you up, buddy. Can you do a cool dolphin jump out of the water? You're goddamn right I can. Check this shit out. Whee! Nope. No, I can't. Not on cue. Whenever I don't want to do it, I do it. How about this one, though? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Woo! I think it's some air, dude. Yeah, that's pretty fun. Oh, yeah! It's a moth that can fly. Yeah, that's logical, I guess. Oh, my. That was... That was intimidating. That giant octopus boy is... Quite a pain in the ass. And yeah, we just found a random island over here. That's pretty fun. Yeah, we went pretty far from home, didn't we? I didn't even realize we got sidetracked quite a bit. I don't think we've been here. Yeah, probably save time. Actually, it looks kind of familiar. Can't tell. We'll save though. Yeah, I think I got here too, right? Yeah. Because if we went over that way. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I've been here. Leave a beacon so you can identify. Yeah, it's not a bad idea. That would clear out some inventory space too. Just want to make sure this is indeed the same one. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's got the base up there. Okay. Okay, then. I think you can beach the sea moth. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's possible. This is Head Crab Island, right? I do need to, uh... What is that tree that I wanted? That's that's probably here, isn't it? Fix this all up right there. Let's go find the bayou tree. Oh, the bulbo. Yeah, there we go. That's what it was. There we go. Sweet. We'll get a few. And... Well, probably... Uh, yeah. Let's get two. Let's get enough. Let's place the beacon down here. I'll do the beacon at this uh, entry point so I know right away once I get here if I get here again. Okay. Give me this. Oh, I guess I have to actually place it, don't I? There we go. No? What? There, now it's working. Okay, cool. Do 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 do. Get my knife back. Get my light. We're good. Repair tool and habitat builder, I guess, would be the fifth. Laser cutter. There we go. You are Head Crab Island. Done. Welcome aboard, Captain. Done. Right? Yep. Got it. Cool. That's neat. Useful little uh, bit of utility there. Who put the S in Island? We want to have those kinds of conversations today. 
Who put the K in night? Why do they call them apartments if they're all stuck together? doop de doop de doo Stay hydrated. Mm. Nom 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 nom. But Second Island also has head crabs. We'll call that Head Crab Island too. The head crabbing. And what's the deal with airplane food? No kidding. A renewal. Can't be sure. Eight months in a row. Welcome on back in, friend. Thank you very much for that resubscription. Appreciate it. Man, we went far from home. Holy hell. Ooh. Later on, Roderick. Have a good night. Thanks for hanging out. No airplane food has gotten real fucking good, though. Has it? I had a decent sandwich on an airplane coming back from Iceland, and that's like the extent of my good airplane food experiences. That was a good sandwich, though. It was a nice, warm sandwich. Tasty bread. Ciabatta, I think. Nah, not ciabatta. They wouldn't have ciabatta on a plane, would they? Must have been just some basic ass boring bread roll, but it was good. Maybe you should fly to Italy, right? Welcome aboard, Captain. This is Life Pod 2 coordinates attached. We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. We'll have to swim for the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. We'll make for the rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Sounds unlikely. All right, then. Well, first of all, I'm gonna get this hatch built again. Not any quartz. Because I need another entry point. It's so inconvenient this way. Got some nice gingerbread cookies on a plane once. That sounds pleasant. Oh shit, you can do a little diagonal hatch. Yeah, okay. Hmm. I think we'll, we will probably just do it like this. Seems fine. Okay. Now, of course, it's time to plant these trees. We could probably just go ahead and cut this out. It's not doing me any good. It was mostly just for decoration. There we go. And you need to go in there. Oh, come on now. God damn it, we gotta cut out the brain coral too. At least we got stuff for organics too. What? Oh, trees are dry plants. Oh, uh, okay. That makes sense. Duh. Trying to drown my trees. Yeah, obviously. That's right. You found them on the island, you dingus. There we go. I guess we can go replant those pretty flowers then, too. You big goof. All right. Fair enough. So... Let me get some of these, actually, and get ourselves some more lube. That's always good. New entry point. Hooray. That just looks terrible. I gotta fix this. I have to do it. Right as rain. Alright, terrific. Oh yeah, and I can make coffee now. I forgot. God damn, all kinds of fun stuff. Okay, so we're gonna fabricate, make some lubricant, some rubber too. Mm-hmm. Leaving on a lube note, I'm just gonna slide right out. <laughs> nice. Later on, Ninja. Thanks for hanging out. Appreciate it. I think I might make a little more glass. Not quite yet, though. Okay, and now, store all these things away in here. Bam, 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 boom. And, let's see about that uh, coffee maker, I guess. Real quick, like. 
It's in here, I imagine. Coffee vending machine. Synthesizes hydrating caffeine-free coffee. That's not what we need. But I guess I'll take it. Yeah, we need to make a whip-up kitchen, right? We'll put this in here. Oh, baby. Decaf, I know. What the fuck? This is nonsense. I <laughs> sure could. Thanks, little robot. Can I have some? That's not Madrina's. Yeah, what the fuck? Coffee bot. <gasps> oh, it needs a cup. I didn't get you cups. I'm sorry. I forgot. Oh, okay. There we go. Real Italian espresso diluted with tasteless American water. Wow. Delicious. Thank you. I'm so glad I have that now. How racist of you. <laughs> What's wrong with uh, American water? How do we ruin water? That takes a special skill. Flint bear. Oh, come on. Damn it. Now you made it real. Now it's just sad. Alright, there we go. What's next? It's a fun little addition to the area here. A bar table would be fun. N used to dispose of nuclear waste. I guess I don't need that yet, because I don't have a nuclear reactor. But maybe one day. Ooh, a power cell charger would be good. An advanced wiring kit. How do we make that? Wiring kit, gold, and computer chip. Okay. Computer chip needs table coral samples, gold, and copper wire. We need silver ore, which I don't think we have any more of, actually. Let's check the precious metals container. Yeah, we're out. Damn. Okay. Hmm... No, this is the battery charger. I'm talking about a power cell charger. This is different. That's for the uh, vehicle stuff. Oh, a med kit fabricator would be good, too. Maybe I should work on that, actually, because I have wanted this for a while. And we need silver ore for that as well. God damn it. Man. Okay. My precious metals. Still can't do the moon pool, either, man. Still waiting on that thing. I'm waiting forever on that thing. Hmm. I guess I just go exploring again. Right? We've got a little bit more inventory space now. I'll go ahead and pop another water real quick. And then, um... Yeah, we definitely don't need, don't need to be bringing these three batteries with me. I'll put away these power cells, too. I guess this lower charge one. Yeah. Let me try to store away a few more things. Oh, God. That's full again. God damn it. Boom, boom. I think the lithium can fit in here. Yeah. Almost. My word, we have so much shit. Way too much water, probably. Yeah, especially with the large filtered water. We definitely don't need four of them, so... First of all, I'll just eat one, I guess. Throw away the salt. You have an infinite supply of that with a filtration machine. Oh, that's true, actually. Yeah, huh? I didn't even think about that anymore. Okay. Well, first of all, I'm going to get rid of this fucking brain coral, too. I don't need this shit. There we go. More lockers. Yeah, I guess so. It's almost time. I can make one. Why not? We'll make one right, uh... Probably right here. Yeah. That sound, man. Yeah, I can't label it, but I think I'd rather have the uh, extra space that the wall locker provides. Right there. Cool. Okay. Extra space again. And... Probably only need like three. We'll put that away. Definitely don't need this, but... Nice as an emergency thing to have, I guess. And then let's go ahead and replace all the batteries on our shit real fast, too. Bam. 
Do 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 do. Bam. Recharge them suckers. Okay, cool. We're good. I'm ready. Yeah, I guess I could leave the habitat builder too. Yep. Okay. Put the laser cutter on spot one. We'll do that. We'll do that. And then, okay. We're ready. I'm ready. I'm fucking ready. Let's go find an objective and some silver while we're at it. CTO used the iPod! <laughs> God damn it. <sighs> Let's go! Nice driving, Bear. I bet we got some stuff in here. There's usually a few unturned rocks in this area. Is that what I think it is? Yes! Nice. Cool. That's good. Mr. Tinted Rock Bear, how dare you. Just gotta wait to see when they drop their teeth, I guess. Okay. Woo! -hoo. Do you have a license for that sea moth, good sir? Can't catch me, Kappa! <laughs> Speeds off at five miles an hour. Stopping by for a limestone act crop along the way. I don't need copper. Yeah, I don't need salt either. Okay, yeah, that used to be a much more precious resource, and now it's like garbage. This is kind of weird. Huh. Two species living in symbiosis. Cool. I don't want to keep it. I don't like its mouth. Oh, it floats to the top. That's cool. It's got to stay sucked onto the rock, I guess. Interesting. Bam, bam, bam. You can attach them to things? Oh, that's cool. God damn, man! There's too many fish! This track is a banger, yeah, for sure. They're kind of like the Octo Balloons from Breath of the Wild, but less useful. Gotcha. So, like, what's going on? All I know is coffee and salt. Yeah, well, I mean, that's a lot of it. Subnautica appears to be a lot of just exploring and survival. That's pretty much the name of the game. You look fun. By which I mean... You look like you want to eat me. All right. You don't remember those guys? Is this new? Goofy looking. Bone shark. That sounds right. Got a pretty neat story too. Yeah, it seems like it. There's a lot of very interesting things going on on the side. Almost there. Hi. Hello, alien. Hello, alien. 
May I help you? Yeah. Oh! What? No! 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 Not cool! Help! Where's my sea moth? I'm gonna die? Where's my sea moth? Where's my fucking sea moth? Gimme! Ah! That's not cool! Get the fuck away! Yikes. Okay. Thank you. Data. No scannables, I guess. PDA, where are you at? This one? I think so. Flotation devices failed. We're flooding. Evacuate. Wait. I can reconfigure the O2 system to act as a bilge pump. It's working. Okay, good news. We're alive and we've stopped sinking. Bad? The oxygen's going to run out in 30 minutes and we're 500 meters down. What do we do? We'll have to use the remaining juice to send a distress call and build whatever gear we can. Then we find a way to the surface. There, look at all the red bubbles on the trees. Yeah, no, it looks like a bit of an infection, huh? Huh. This root system is generally extended from one cave wall to another. Penetrates in the rock and continues to grow. Interesting. Dial or Diafall Eternal. Finally finished the darkest dungeon playthrough. Yeah, we'll probably get into a modded run eventually. I wouldn't I wouldn't count it out. It's always a good time. Corruption has soaked the soil. Oh shit, yo, this isn't the uh, headcrab island. These are just like random chunks of land, I guess. Cool. That's neat. Another bone shark. Big old floater boys, yeah. Still looking for silver, too. Hmm. Can I scan this? No. I'm gonna get back in my thing. Good metal band name. Yeah, I don't disagree with that. Here we go. Gold! Suspended here suggest they once floated on the surface. I'll take that. That's pretty neat. A little tidbit there. Scan Bone Shock! Where even did he go? I don't see him anymore. There he is. Here, Sharky, Sharky. Come here, bud. Don't get too close. I don't want to do that. <laughs> Doesn't seem like a good idea. I don't have a sea glide with me. Seems sketchy. Ah! God damn it, I thought it was here. Get out of here. He mad. He mad. He's an angry boy. Owie. 
He's fast too, Jesus. See ya. Help, I'm stuck here, I don. More stuff, please. Gold! Ooh, it's too many sharks. Too many sharks, man. I don't like the amount of sharks we got going on out here. Hi, Don. I'm dead. Ha! <laughs> Woo! Give me that. There we go. Okay. That works. I'm gonna get fucking ambushed. I know it. See, this guy down here. Yeah, he's just waiting for it. There's too many sharks. Too many sharks. Lots of shit to explore, though. Ooh, damn! Lots of stuff. Silver, finally. There we go. I'll take the titanium here. I guess I should keep something out so I can break things quicker. Silver. There we go. Goods. Scan? No? Okay. Oh, here we go. Earthen coral tubes. Beautiful. Okay, keep going. This has been a nice find, anyway. Good resources. Felt like I was about to be bit for a second there, but we're good. Hell yeah. Let's get out of here. I'm ready. Lots of metal salvage out here. Again, still yet to find the damn moon pod. I had to go <laughs> directly into the face of a fish. Oh yeah, my radio was beeping too, right? I forgot about that. Yeah, people keep saying red kelp area, so we'll probably go back there. Bonk! Ugh. It does feel nice coming back home. It's a sense of familiarity in the cruel, bleak world. Mushroom forest needs to be explored now, right? Yeah, that too. All this new shit. Okay. So there's some good precious metals. Just store all this in the new locker and play this radio message. Play partially translated broadcast. Destroyed mode. Patrol. New targets unaccounted for. One. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. Yay! Fun. That's good. Mm-hmm. Num 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 num. I'm in danger. <laughs> Love that Ralph Wiggumism. Uh, give me that. 
And give me that. We need to make a power cell charger, first of all, which requires an advanced wiring kit. And then we also need to make a medical kit fabricator, which requires a computer chip and silver ore, which we did get as well. So hopefully we got the resources at this point. Did it just not give me the coffee? There we go. There we go. Yeah, wireless coffee. That was pretty sick. Sir, you are being hunted. I am familiar with that feeling. All right, let's see. First of all, we need the advanced wiring kit. To get there, we need to get the wiring kit. So let's do that. I don't know if you can take the fabricator from the life pod. Good question. Table coral sample, gold and copper wire. All right. Pop, pop. Gold. Copper. Already got those, obviously. Maybe I got a resource. Manage well. Show me how to make oxygen work on your base. I just started and can't figure it out. Yeah, all I did was build a solar panel, and that gave me power, and that started giving me O2 in the base as well. So I've just got a couple of solar panels popped up on top of the base up there. All right, it's computer chip done. Welcome to the bear pile. Helkizen! Thank you so much for your subscription, my friend. Appreciate it. Welcome on into the bear pile. Bear hugs, please, in the chat for the support. Thank you so much. I gotta find a single silver ore. Along with making fiber mesh, which requires what? I gotta remember what that is again. Creep vine sample, I see, okay. Two of them. And then, do we have silver anywhere? Oh, I do have silver. Duh, okay, there we go. And, so we need to get gold for the advanced wiring kit. What was that for? I forgot what the advanced wiring kit was for. Oh, right, yeah, the power cell charger. And then we have rubies and titanium for that. And yeah, we need to get creep vine and then get titanium, then we're good to go. Cool. Dope. My creep vine. Oh wait, no, I shouldn't take the one I have. Yeah, that's not smart. Whoops. Let's put that back. <laughs> I'm gonna go get the one that's out of here. Oh, I cut the shit I'm planting. Yeah, I'm kind of missing my sea glide already. I think I might put that back in the inventory. <laughs> you farted. There we go. Let's get some fiber mesh. Hey, big boy. Why is your knife on fucking fire? Because I got a badass knife. That's why. I just don't know how to use it. Apparently. Down we go. <laughs> Cut my plant into pieces. This is my glowing knife. Suffocation. No breathing because I'm underwater and that makes sense. Yep. Titanium. Here we go. Titanium. There it is. Finally. Finally. My God, I've been trying to build that forever. He's done it. Medical kit fabricator. On the way. Speaking of which. Give me this. Thank you. All right. Actually, let me, t let me see if I can actually uh, deconstruct anything up here. Hell yeah, cool. Oh, come on. Come on, let me do it. It's bullshit. Bullshit, fine. I should be able to. Nonsense. All right, now rubies. I need the advanced wiring kit, which we need to make with, well, we need to make another wiring kit, I guess. Um. Oh, I have the wiring kit, right, but we need gold and a computer chip. For the computer chip, we need table coral sample gold and copper wire. Okay, so we need a lot of gold. Perfect. 
And then boop boop. And some copper. I don't think I have any more copper. Oh, I do. Okay. Uh, copper wire. Boom. And then boom. And then nice. Then we need one more titanium and a couple of rubies and we're good to go. I don't know where the rubies went though. I still have rubies, right? Yeah, definitely. Cool. Okay. Let's whip it up. Oh, one more titanium. There we go. Cool. Power cell charger. I don't think I want to do that across from there. That's going to look weird. We'll do that. We can do that there, I guess. It's a little awkward. I want to use the space. Uh, yeah, let's put it in here. Yeah, that looks better. Nice and fancy. There we go. Cool. Dope. Charge two at a time, huh? Okay. Aesthetic, you know it. Mm-hmm. Done. Cool. We're getting all this shit going. Look at this. Feeling good, man. Not a lot of space to work with here, but it works. It does the job. Feeling it. We're feeling it. Okay, what's next? What's next? We got all the good stuff. Power cell charger complete. Welcome to the bear pile. Platinum only. Welcome to the bear pile. Thank you very much for your Twitch Prime sub. Appreciate it. Enjoy your badge and emotes. Let me go find that moon pod, man. That's what I got to do for sure. So let's go. Let's get back into that red kelp area. Let's go find that fucking moon pod. Let's do it. Build a trash can already. No way. I will never throw away anything. Welcome aboard, Captain. Moon pool, right? Yeah, not moon pod. Moon pool. I'm also going the wrong way. This way. Welcome oh, the mod. To the bear pile. Thank you for your subscription as well. Welcome to the bear pile. I appreciate it. Enjoy your badge and emails, buddy. Bear hugs, please. Thank you for the support. We need a counter for how many times he said moon pod. I only say it that often because we bought a product called a moon pod recently. <laughs> I need to repair this thing too, actually. Hang on, I should probably go ahead and do that. Yeah, come chase me up to the s surface, bitch. Can't breathe up here. I'll fix you up. What does my moon pod do? It's like a bean bag, but it's real nice. The same company that made the gravity blanket that a lot of people were tweeting about last year. What the hell are you doing over here? It's real nice. I actually like it a lot. Supports my back really well. You kind of out of place there, pal. All right, so we found this wreck already. Build a gun at some point so you can shoot some fuckers. Yeah, I do need some kind of weapon. I've been going like amnesia style this whole time. Defenseless. So we've already cut through here, obviously. So let's keep on a sharp eye out. Oh my lord! Hmm. Keep going through the moss, I guess. Yeah, the triple kill, seriously. What are you guys doing here? Silly reef backs. So I gotta actually, like... Oh my god, I don't even know how that fucking happened. I need to prioritize making the uh, the mech suit probably so I can get those resources because that's going to be a great way to stock up on the metals, I'm sure. <laughs> no, 
I'm kind of just doing it for fun. Ah, here we go. Right? This has got to be it. Oh, fuck away. Might have already been here too, though. Yeah, I was definitely already here because I went through there, right? Oh, no, no, no. You can't access that. Okay. So maybe not. Stop destroying the local fauna, please. Obviously don't need that. Uh, uh, hi. Hey, hi there. Hi, pal. Just chasing me around. Been by here at least, right? Yeah. Hmm. I have explored the Aurora, yeah. Yielded some results. Okay, I'm not seeing a lot left to do in this particular area. Let me check out this upper part. Ooh, sealed door. Right? No? God damn it. I thought for sure. Not the right kind of door. Uh. Get in there, really? Come on, you can fit in there. Son of a bitch. You can't just cut willy-nilly. I mean, you should be able to. But I understand. Finally? No? God damn it. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. No, still not. God damn it. Oh, damage wiring. There we go. Oh, I'm so disoriented right now. Well, that doesn't seem good. Shibble bibble bibble bip. Uh huh. Totally. Absolutely. Ooh, prawn suit fragment. Sure, I would have been more excited about that a little while ago. Modification station fragment. Made a shake shish shish. I know, I need, I need air soon, I know. And we got that data. I better go get air, hang on. Because I am disoriented. Come over here. You come over this way so we don't have to swim all the way across again. Just ignore him. He's just mad because he's hungry. Hungry boy. God, this is so disorienting sometimes. Well, we're in. For what, though? Another floodlight that I can't scan. There's really nothing in here. Spots to repair. Oh. I see. Well, that's the laser cutter. Wait, no, we're not... Are we actually having to repair this shit? No, I don't think that's what we're supposed to do, is it? We can go up here. Ah, here we go. Lost in space. Dishonorably discharged from the TSF for going off mission. Ooh. Interesting. Let's 
Scannable? No. Oh, I could have just gone in this way. Whoops. Do 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 do. Not seeing anything else. Any more scannables? Maybe that? No. All right. With the power of flex seal, anything is possible. That's right. There's a giant asshole right there. I didn't even realize. All right. Moon pool fragments should be outside on the sand. Okay. To show you the power of flex tape, I saw this boat in half. <laughs> Hi, hey bud. I'll scan you. I'll do it. I'll fucking scan you. Scan the shit out of you. He's a spazzy boy. You're a spazzy boy. You're a spazzy boy! You got energy. There we go. Don't scam me, I'm Ryan. <laughs> oh, fuck! Ow. I'm not seeing moon pool shit. Down on the cave bear, okay. I can do that. Oh. 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 Oh, hang on. Hang on. We don't do that without our without our sea moth. Welcome aboard, Captain. Scan him with a knife. There we go. Ooh, back to the mushroom forest. Oh, please feel free, Magos. Yeah, images are fine. As long as they're not NSFW. Since when does Bear go into caves like some sort of spelunker? That doesn't seem like a thing I would do, yeah. Well, okay, I don't want to be down here, though, because I know what's going on with this. we got to get back up and see if we can find the moon pool. Por favor. Because I really, really want it. And I have wanted it for so long. So let's keep following the red moss, I guess. Because that's the only thing I've heard is a point of guidance for discovering that thing. Here, moon pool, moon pool, moon pool. Another salt deposit. Try checking the moon. Didn't occur to me, actually. Maybe I give that a go. Oh. Ooh, we're getting into the the unknown again. Hello, two hundred meters. Nice to see you. Another vent. Probably don't need to scan this one, but I'll take a peek. Yeah, okay. Have a little water. Ooh, boy. I'm just wandering at this point. 
Off we go. I like seeing you. Just gonna run away. That's a lot of sand, yeah. We're getting deep, too. We're getting real deep. Oh, boy. Oh, 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 man. Even deeper. It's kind of going in a circle now, but I just keep going deeper. Deeper and deeper in. I don't like that. Oh, boy. Local scans show a nearby opening, leading to a biome with extensive fossilized remains. Really? Huh. Really? Huh. Look at that. Hello, friends. Interesting. Cool. There's a ruby there. Grab that. Okay. What do we have here? I think I've already scanned this, but I'll have another look. Oh, no, I have none. A moboid. Hmm. Oh, boy. Hello. Ooh, man. Look at the teeth on this son of a bitch. You can scan the big skull. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Big boy. The skeleton of a million-year-old armored carnivore. Wow. Larger than any living creature encountered on the planet. I'm swimming around inside him. A magnanimous dispensation. Oh, shit. Dabbing Panda! With the $5 tip, thank you very much. Appreciate that. I'm sorry, I can't actually read the message right now because I don't have the alert thing popped up, but thank you. Thank you, thank you very much for the tip. This is a cool place. I'm going to be uh, wrapping up pretty soon, Miles. This will be the last bit of exploration for today, I think. Oh, man. There's a few rubies down here. This is so, like, what is this little murkiness down here? It's like, it's not water. We're in water. What is that? Brine. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Probably save is recommended. Not a bad idea. <laughs> Take a swim and find out, yeah. Another radio message, too. Man, we are really deep. Yo! Terrain scans indicate this biome contains unusually high concentrations of organic and fossilized remains. Wow. Ooh, hello. Huh. I don't like you. I don't like you. Go away. Go away. You're getting closer. I don't like you at all. Oh boy. Yeah, you're coming toward me. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Go away. Ah! 
Ah! Uh. I'm gonna hide in this mouth. Certainly I'll be safe here. I scan these guys. Okay, okay. I'm gonna leave. I don't feel very good about this. Yeah, he doesn't like me. He don't like me none at all. Ghosty boy. Oh boy, I am not gonna be able to get out of here, am I? Oh shit. Ruby. At least I have another power cell. Whew. Easy bear, just build, yeah. Alright, I think I'll be able to find a way. It's stressful, yeah, seriously. Going this deep, you never know how dangerous it's gonna get. Uh, hello. Goodbye. Yeah. Yo, holy shit. What are these beams? What the hell is going on with this? Holy hell. Okay, hang on. I gotta scan this boy too. From the inside. Whoa, what? Why? We're good. It's hot! Oh, the brine, I bet, huh? Yeah. Real toasty. Oh, is it this thing? Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Hot water. Real hot water. Oh my god, I just noticed the temperature outside. Holy fuck. 71 Celsius. My lord. Yo, this is cool. What the hell? Gotta scan that big tree, absolutely. Whoa, we're at 900! Oh my god, be careful, yeah. Giant cove tree. Cool. Wow. I gotta scan one of these boys, too. Hello. Can I scan you? You mind? Thank you. Just a, just a little scan. Just a little scan, no big deal. Just a little scan of Reno. Just a little scan. There we go. Oof. This is real calm. I like this a lot. This would be a good place for a base, right? Yeah. I had a base in the cave, that's cool. Read about the tree. What did we find out about that just now? That would be... Hmm. No, not land. Giant cove tree. A vast tree encountered in a deep cove, the only one of its kind encountered on the planet. Surrounded by rays grazing on its pink outer leaves. An ancient nesting ground. Yo, look, the tree's branches are wrapped around a number of maturing eggs. Those are fucking leviathan eggs? Bye!
That was peaceful for a minute. Oh, this is the opposite way. Oh, shit. Well, we'll try this anyway. Make an omelet, yeah. Tasty. Where's my inventory? Oh, we got a lot of space, actually. Could grab some rubies if I really want to. And we went deep today. Oh my god. Still no moon pool, but well, some fun exploration anyway. Make Leviathan caviar. Nummy nummy. Jesus. Uh. Oh, God. <laughs> it's a little on edge. Fuck. Ah, stop it. God damn it. So deep. Lozne gifted a sub yesterday. I'm glad he could get the bear hugs out. Absolutely. What the fuck just happened? Did y'all see that? That thing just warped out of existence. Oh, this might be what I'm looking for. Oh, no, no. This is. Oh, I've been here. Yeah, damn it. Ah, oh, fuck. I thought it was the moon pool. Oh, well. A g, g g ghost Leviathan! <laughs> oh my god, I can see the surface! I made it. The green part is called the Lost River, you can tell why. I can. I'm free. I'm free. Oh my god, yeah, still no moon pool though, maybe one day. Whatever. Okay, fine. I kill fish. That's just what I do when I get in the sea moth. I just kill fish all day. What? Thunk. Bam. I'm gonna need the awesome mech suit if we want to go deeper. Alright. Some good stuff anyway. Just in case. Just in case. Bunch of titanium in here, anyway. Skin around the wreck as well, yeah. I haven't even been in here. Clearly. Another goddamn battery charger fragment. I got batteries for days. Titanium for days, I mean. Oh, all right then. Not all that exciting. Nor do I need the metal salvage. Scanner room fragment again. Oh, I think I needed this actually, didn't I? Yeah! Hey, okay! So we got something! Hooray! And there's a cuttable door? Oh shit! Let's go! Let's go. Scanner room is cool. I'll probably whip that up before we head off today. I really like the way the door cutting works. It's very satisfying. Especially because you can push the thing out of the way afterward. Alright, that's not all that great. God, how many of these do we need? There's like six of them here. Okay. Ugh, man. 
Didn't get the right stuff. Yeah, no, I understand it so I miss or so I don't miss that stuff, but it's like, geez, you need like six of them in the same place. Alright, well there's that. Oh, hold on. Just kidding. The fuck? Why what's the point of that? You can cut the grills. Oh. This? Or this? What are you talking about? Baited. God damn you. Motherfucker. I believe anything you say. I believe literally any word that comes out of Twitch chat. You know that about me. Let's go get a scanner room. There, I made this game. Ah, oh, it's a good game, Sportaflop. Sorry I keep killing all the fish. I'm doing it on purpose now, though. <laughs> Ocean GTA. <laughs> I'm Spartacus. Oh, cool. Hi, Spartacus. I'm dead. Dunk. Dunk, dunk. I'm gonna bring a little more creep vine home, too, actually, so we can get some more fiber mesh. Just kidding! I got a full inventory. Let's get rid of some titanium. There we go. I'm gonna destroy my Seamoth, yeah, probably. Might need a few repairs, we'll fix it up. I pulled off my first high hungry I'm dad on my kid the other night and I'm, unre I'm unreasonably proud of myself. It's a special moment in your life. Congratulations, I'm proud of you. All fixed. Get the power cell fixed up too. Or repaired or not repaired, uh, replaced. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, robot. Um, uh, first of all. Oh yeah, full inventory. Boo 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 boo. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Been having a pretty crappy day, but watching your enthusiasm has really cheered me up. Thank you. I'm glad to hear it, Maida. Ma Maida. I know how the crappy days can be. I'm glad I've been able to have this game to provide me with a natural source of enthusiasm. This has been terrific. Robophilia! Thank you very much for your four months in a row, buddy. Welcome on back in. Appreciate you. Should we continue badge and emote use? Thank you very much. Okay, time to dump more stuff. Got lots of titanium now. That feels a little better. And uh, we'll just consume that. I need some food, actually. I gotta get some more uh, potatoes. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Just put that in there, I guess. That's fine. Um, yeah. Taters! What's taters, precious? Yep. Yep. Num 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 num. There we go, all better. You gotta love that bulbo tree. You gotta love that bulbo tree, baby. I'm gonna get one more creep vine sample so we get the fiber mesh and it doesn't look like an odd amount of shit I've got. Boil them, mash them, stick them in my stew. Stick them in my stew. Stick them, stick it in my stew, guys. Just stick it right up my stew. Did you do that for me, Twitch chat? I gotta, I gotta stop my stream. Clearly, I'm getting, I'm getting way off the rails. I'm getting out of hand. Stick it up my stew pipe. 
Don't forget the radio. Oh, yeah. I did indeed. Oh, hi! Uh-huh. Cool. Interesting stuff. Yeah, great. I feel fine. I feel great. I feel really good. Very comfortable. <laughs> Understandable. Have a nice day. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. This is what I get for having my windows open and watching your stream. Lesson learned. Penis! Sorry, I, I like... Set that up for me. I mean, come on. Come on, man. Anyway, thanks for watching the stream today, y'all. Hope you had a good time. <laughs> I really appreciate you tuning in. It was a lot of fun. I really like Subnautica, and I'm going to keep playing more of this game. It's, uh, it's provided me lots of enter entertainment. Lots of natural bread enthusiasm. But I uh, look forward to continuing here. My window is closed, but my headphones are open-ended, and my roommates are looking at me weird. <laughs> oh, just love to make you regret the decision to stick by with me here for the last three hours. It's my favorite part of the day. This is, this is real pleasant, isn't it? Look at this view, huh? Yeah. Alright. Thanks for watching, everybody. Lots of fun. Appreciate your time here. Plenty more Subnautica to come, I'm, I'm sure, in the in the future here. The Bear Taffy channel. Feel free to follow if this is your first time here. You can watch. I'm live usually on the weekdays between, uh, you know, 9 and 10 a.m. Pacific. It's been typically the case here. And, of course, don't miss Spelunky Saturday. Every Saturday at 10 a.m. here on the channel, which will be tomorrow, of course. Come on by for some spelunking. We'll do the daily challenge. It'll be a bunch of fun. And then more subnut on Monday, of course. Thanks for watching. <laughs>